Hey guys, what's going on? It's me, Cytrix here. Welcome back to some more Mario Kart 8 Deluxe. So today, again, we are going to be going ahead for the DLC courses. This time, we're going to be playing the Lucky Cat course. As to our last episode, as we played the Golden Dash course, which I enjoy doing again so much. But sooner or later, these courses are going to get old, and I really want to play some more, more of these Mario Kart DLCs. And I hope Nintendo launches them pretty more sooner rather than later. So let's see. And while I'm trying to put together my cart, please hit that like button and subscribe for some more videos from yours truly, when in the future. Let's see... Uh, let's go with this. Acceleration's good, handling is good. Where is Metal Wheels handling? Hmm. What will be great in the DLC is I hope that they actually decide to bring out some more customization to the parts and more characters. But then again, that's just wishful thinking. We don't know how we all know how Nintendo thinks sometimes, and sometimes they don't like to do rationality. So uh, I'm talking m enough right now. So let's just go ahead with Lucky Cat Cor Lucky Cat Cup, and see what we can do with this new card combination I just randomly threw together. Because every, because everybody has no time to think about Nintendo. Ain't nobody got time for that. Let's see. Here we go in Tokyo Blur from Tour. I love this map a lot. I just like driving here is just... I don't know. Experiencing Tokyo here. Like, like this is got everyone saying, Oh no, Fast and Furious now in Mario Kart 8. <laughs> oh yeah, it's Mario Kart 8. Like, now Tokyo Drift. Where's Vin Diesel? Why isn't he playable here? I mean, he they just didn't, wasn't offering him enough money and he wouldn't take it. I say, yeah, well, that's how it is. The celebrities are actually getting the, a good, the good brunt of the movie. They said, like most, like most people, I don't know. There's some actors who said they're overacted. <laughs> wow, he just got hit by his own shell. <laughs> uh, that that is Yoshi for you. Um, what I was saying though, no, yeah. Uh, a lot of celebrities these days, like, unless the game pl they're playing a lot more, the game paid a lot more for the roles, like, they, they feel like they're just getting long and drawn out for all of this. And I mean, why would you think that? It's not that, it's not that bad. I mean, if you like the, the, care, the series, don't just let it die. I mean, a lot of people so base their life off of your movies. Like, a lot of good things come out of those things. Don't, you had a good impact in the world and you just want it to end? I mean, there are some lines where you said, enough is enough, and I agree with that, but if you're just like midway through in the franchise and you just decided one day you're not going to do it anymore, that's just kind of selfish, don't you think? But, I don't know. I, I, know, I don't know anything about acting. I mean, apart from doing things on YouTube, but um, no, I'm not that g uh, good at acting at all. Ah! Why am I not surprised? Why am I not surprised that happened? Don't you dare, Toad. Gotcha. Yep, I got away. If it wasn't for that straight shooting green shell, I would have never gotten him. <laughs> I'm so glad I hit him in the end, though. <laughs> oh, wow. Okay, here we go. Oh, Shroom Ridge. I hated this course in, D in DS. Because my friends would always just push me into the moving cars and just drive past me. That is just a dirty way of wi and toxic way of winning. But that's just basically how everyone else decided to do it. And for you guys who have maybe noticed, I'm not really that skilled in motorcycles, so I just decided to stick with carts because I find them way more easier to maneuver. For me, that's my take on it. I mean, there are people who rather motorcycles than ATVs or basically just um, cars in general in this game, but for me, I'm just, I'm all for the carts. And sometimes I will drive ATVs because they're the closest thing between a cart and a motorcycle for me. Dang, what's with the red shells in this game? Ah, oh, yeah, leave me alone. 
I'm innocently driving here. I have my driver's permit. Nuts. Toes right on my tail. But I'm not letting any of you pass me. Just brick I'm just brick drifting a lot here and it's helping me out so far. And I'm accelerating to the max, trying to stay ahead of these guys. You see? I can't drop my guard against these guys for even a moment because before they give me another um Ah oh, nuts. They're getting closer. Ah what? No 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 no. That's that was a crook kid shot. Ah, I alright, I spent too much time drifting there. What in the hell? Bowser, get your big ass out of my way. Got him. Got him. Alright, just drift in here. I win. Whew, that was close. Okay, I really just hate losing to these computers. Like, if you to me, if you lose to a computer, it's like, you don't have any actual skill. Like, you're not good at online, now you're not good at on on against computers because let me tell you I suck on online I always can either fourth f um fifth or dead last and for me that's like an average standard for a good pl a good enough player but I don't know I'm just so damn competitive it's just like in my nature just to try to be the better in all of it and my wheel link oh yeah and that reminds me for what I heard about from the Zelda sequel, Breath of the Wild sequel, I heard it was officially delayed until spring 2023. I know a lot of people are disappointed by this, but again, it gives them a good chance to refine the game a little more to make it that much more greater than the original game, because there are a lot of elements that weren't were exactly that makes sense in that game to me. like. There, there was a weapon duration system, like, every the more you often you use your weapons, the more chance to have a breaking, but you don't give you an option to at least mend your items, and that's... That's just... Why didn't they do that? Why didn't they do that? Like, you can reinforce a weapon and prevent it from breaking or something. Get out of my way, that's payback. Yeah, and I... Yeah, I hold a grudge, okay? I will... Anyone who red shells me, I will red shell you back. So... Uh... What I was saying, yeah, so it gives them a good, a better chance to refine the items there. They give you a chance, maybe in for a game, uh, they actually let you for once play a Zelda. Or you could, what was the word? You could probably like, yeah, but the re the mending and reinforcing your and fixing your, item, your weapons thing is, is a good thing. Because suppose you find a rare, a weapon. And then it, you've, it's just at the duration where it breaks, and then you have to go through the whole ordeal again just to, uh, to win it again, and just to find it, or just get the materials to build it again. That's, that would just be such a, tr a chore. So, if they could add a feature where you could just fix your items, while like getting the necessary components to repair it, then that would be a great addition to the game. I don't play L Zelda all that much, but at least I know what I would like in a game. So you wouldn't feel like it's a total bummer, in a way. Alright, so here we are in the final course here now for Ninja Hideaway. I don't know why they, do, they don't label it as a tour course, because it was in Mario Kart Tour, so why did they why did they scrap it? I don't know, they're keeping it like it's actually a fresh new course, which is not. Here we go. So, to get back here, you know you're in the wrong spot. Ah! Okay, everyone's just saying they're doing it work. Everyone's, I'm just trying to get a, a hop boost. A stunt boost. Okay, ah! 
I forgot these shit guys like to just pop out out of nowhere. Ooh. I saw you. Link, get back here. You're in my spot. Oh, that was my phone, sorry. What? He guarded that? Nuts. The one thing I can't learn is to just dodge those things properly. Oh, I've got you now. Oh, no! Ah, oh, that's why I hate falling here. This is my least favorite map from Tor, by the way. Ah, you see? Ah. Number one is all the way I aim for. Wow, I missed him on every shot. Ah. Oof. Out of the way, Link. I'm winning this. Oh! Well, actually, that kind of did me a favor because I need to slow down here on this turn. Mm. Me. Yes. Okay. Back down. Ooh, and Bowser's gaining on me. Oh. That's not where I wanted to drift. Here I go. But a skin of my teeth, I won. <sighs> okay, so yeah, that is it. Wit lucky cat course completed. Another three stars. So yeah, that that's pretty much it. I can't wait for more DLC courses to come out, people. If you are enjoying these videos, and uh, please let me leave a like and also subscribe to my channel for some future more content if you want to see some more Mario Kart and other things gaming. And I hope you guys have a good rest of your day. Stay safe. Goodbye.